Uh, hey everybody, Mr. Nation Wine here. Just another vlog in the afternoon. Just uh, just with my mom over in Curtis. Picked up a few things, but I uh, forgot uh, one more rhyme. So I said, just wait in the car and just do the vlog. So we're just in her car. The 91 Buick Park Avenue. So that's about 100,668 miles. So that's not bad for a 91 Buick. Yeah, so not a whole lot of stuff to do in, in this car. Because, uh, well, it's been purchased a long time ago. I just took uh, good care of it. It's very lucky. Yeah, for me, but I'm not, for me, I'm not l that lucky getting cars with little miles and then just, you know, starting out fresh. Yeah, so it's going to take forever just to buy a brand new car and just put all the miles I want myself. Yeah, I even had a goal, like, whatever car I buy that I like so much, so I'd like to put a million miles on it. But there's going to be, like, maybe a, Injury ball, maybe change the engine, maybe transmissions, and then the, the axles and all that stuff. So, I mean, I think it's the first year your Buick had an airbag in this car because it says Super Mental Flammable Restraint. So, but basically, in GM's terms, it means a Super Mental Restraint System. Yeah, so, I mean, we only had the driver's side airbag. This doesn't have a passenger side airbag. That's just the glove box door. I think uh, maybe in the later models they just uh, relocate the glove box door here and use this area for the airbag, just like my truck. So you know, GM, you know, they make some good cars and stuff. Yeah, I just don't like that part about the bailout. But but that's already been forgotten about, anyways. So anyway, uh, I went and drop off the truck over and. Uh, Amco today says that they do finances on repairs. They even have free diagnostic. So just dropped off to see if uh, what's going on with the wheel bearing, if that had to be changed, and if the the CV joint axle shaft, the hub that sticks out where you put the nut in, just make sure it's not you know rounded off uh, to get in contact with the wheel bearing hub itself. I'm just hoping it wasn't like that because it's been doing that since Sunday. So I think I went 10 miles Sunday, and I might have went almost uh, 20 miles yesterday. Yeah, because yesterday, you know, I just went over to the store to get a couple things, and then I went to the library, you know, when I made the video yesterday, and then over to work. And then from work over to home, you know, to eat some dinner, and then from there to the lock and load it, and then back home. So it could be a whole lot of driving anyway. It's not even that far. Because I think my house is about probably two miles away. Yeah. Yeah, I was just seeing what's going on from outside, just in case you didn't know. Yeah. So, anyway, you gotta, you gotta check out the CD head unit. This has been put installed by eh, maybe three years ago. Yeah, I said I wanted to install it, but there's so much stuff you had to get to it. So, anyway, I'm about finished with my vlog, so I'll see you later.